Let me go back, turn the clock back to April when we last spoke when you were visiting India. And I remember that time the sword that was hanging was the Gar sword, the retrospective amendments that had come out in the budget. The mood was so negative. We seem to have come a long way since then, haven't we? Yes, hi Vivek. We really have made a lot of progress and, and much of that progress has been made in the last couple of months. Uh, since the finance minister changed to Mr. Chidandram, uh, we've had a lot of announcements of reform. And I think to everyone's surprise, we're beginning to see some of that reform being passed by Parliament. I mean, to get this FDI into, in retail through both the lock and the Raj Sabbath, I think is a great result and surprises nearly all the investors I speak to. You use the word announcement, and in fact, that's really... Uh, the larger issue, that at this point many believe that these are announcements, while yes, you're right, we saw this uh, uh, very strong sense of commitment on the part of the government to successfully push through the FDI and retail in Parliament, but a lot of the other reforms are at this point of time still just announcements. Well, Vivek, that is correct, but remember that a few months ago there was no talk of reform, then we have talk of reform with a lot of cynicism about whether that reform will be passed. What could be passed by the executive has been, and we're now beginning to see some progress through the Parliament. And our base case was that most of these would not actually be uh, reviewed by the Parliament until we got to the budget session of Parliament. So we're running ahead of schedule. And again, we're doing this from the, a level of skepticism that was very high. So these are absolutely positive surprises for the market.